The sense of emergency in tackling the wildfires simply isn't mirrored by Australia's politics. Scientists say the gravity of the wildfires is directly linked to greenhouse gases making the planet warmer. Yet for nearly a decade, Australia's government has failed to take climate change seriously. This is coal. Don't be afraid. The Don't treasurer. be scared. 2017, and Australia's now Prime Minister Scott Morrison lords carbon-emitting fossil fuels in Parliament, showing zero cognizance of the need for clean energy. Those opposite have an ideological, pathological fear of coal. Even at a major climate conference in Madrid just a few weeks ago, Australian delegates were accused of acting outside the spirit of the Paris Agreement designed to limit global warming. The Australians just kind of weren't really playing ball, were they? Bob Ward from the London School of Economics was an official observer at the Madrid conference and witnessed the Australian tactics firsthand. Australia was trying to insert a loophole in the rules that would allow it to get out of doing its full share of emissions cuts up to 2030 because it wanted credit for the fact that its emissions have not risen quite as much as expected by 2020. Australia's climate protesters say the government is clamping down on climate activism. This video from a few days ago went viral. 